What's good? What's popping? My name is Pam Tanga, and you are about to get to know me. South African live performers. There's a guy I saw in Cape Town. I was at an event in Cape Town called Community, and a guy called Bravo LaRue performed and he absolutely smashed it. He was absolutely amazing. Stage presence, dancing, and just like keeping the crowd engaged. That was amazing. The second one would definitely be Casper Neves. He's absolutely amazing at what uh, he does. And uh, last one would be Kamumpila. Oh my, oh my goodness, I have a girl crush on Kamumpila. She has the most amazing stage presence and I really can't wait for the rest of the world to continue to see her because she's already international. So yeah. So I love creating playlists. So I actually do create playlists and post them on my social media. So I definitely love playlisting songs. I hate shuffle because it's like one 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 moment you're listening to your celebration. Next thing, Umamele, a heartbreak song, it just doesn't make sense. I don't like shuffle at all, but like I really love playlisting a song because it kind of just like centers your emotion and emotions and takes you along this one journey. Because if you listen to so many music, so many different types of genres at the same time, I it doesn't work out for me. Definitely, guys, I'm a piano is taking the world by storm. Look at Gabon Pella, Anko Waffles, Focalistic is barely in the country. Major league DJs are barely in the country. They literally everyone is in the country for like a week and then they go back. It's because they're so in demand. Everyone is just loving the new wave. It's really our um its own sound and I appreciate that so much. I just wish that we could also invest more in Amapiano festivals and making sure we're make, making sure that we're making so much loud of a noise because it's our genre. It originated here and I'm so proud to be South African. Um, and one of the things that made me proud to be South African is definitely Amapiano. Definitely. So it definitely is me. If I could rank my massive music performances, I will start with a focalistic one I've watched on TV. And um, one other one that I really liked was Ritabile Kumalo on my first uh, BTS shadowing day here at Massive Music. It was absolutely amazing. What a great way to introduce me to the show. And then the last one would definitely be, I forgot the artist, but like, and this is Andaza. Yes, that one was absolutely amazing. Like I've I've been hearing the song on radio and on TV, but like when I heard it here, I was like, hi. <laughs>